Hello lords and ladies, welcome back to Cartoon Hangout, your place for all things cartoon. Right off the bat, I think we have another fantastic classic Scooby-Doo episode with A Night of Fright and Snow Delight. If you haven't seen the episode in a long time, you may be more familiar with its modern counterpart, where there's a will, there's a wraith, from Be Cool Scooby-Doo. The new take on it was really funny, but the original is just as fun. Just like in the modern retelling, Scooby finds himself inheriting a great fortune from a man he saved years ago, and has to spend the night in a creepy mansion along with Sanders' other relatives. It's an insanely outrageous and downright amusing premise for an episode, and I just loved it. First off, the island mansion sets up the scene perfectly, and really lets you know the gang is in for a night of fright. It's also a very striking scene in and of itself. Almost feels right out of something like Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas or Dark Shadows. Now, I called the last episode the funniest episode to date, but I'll admit, episode 16 definitely gives it a run for his money with quite a few comedic moments that had me more than chuckling. Scenes like Scooby, Shaggy, and Velma being chased by a floating uniform piloted by a duck, or my favorite moment, this one. Faster! They're like gaining on us! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You don't laugh at that, you're not human. The rest of the episode may seem a little bare bones in comparison to the update it received in Be Cool Scooby Doo, what with very little screen time being given to the relatives themselves, but I promise you it holds up very well even with the newer version in mind. This to me is actually the most intricate involved episode yet. A few other episodes felt like not much was really going on, but the gang spent a good bit of the runtime exploring the mansion or escaping from the giggling green phantoms. Speaking of the ghosts, I adore these two villains so much. I think I said as much in the remake, but it's still true. Not missing a beat, the writers refused to let them sound too familiar to another ghost the Scooby Gang has encountered episodes ago, and instead gave them a really odd laugh. More like they're just saying gibberish, but I'm told it's more of a giggle. Hence why some refer to them as the Giggling Green Phantoms. Either way, they were amazing in this episode, appearing all over the mansion causing problems. And it was hysterical how they had secret panels all over the place for some inexplicable reason. I suppose they were more funny than creepy, but that's not a bad thing. I could probably drone on and on about this episode, but let's wrap it up. Episode 16 is another amazing Scooby-Doo episode that if you've yet to experience for yourself, you should take the time to do so. And then maybe watch Be Cool Scooby-Doo's take on it. If you have seen it though, let me know your thoughts on it down below. And for more Scooby-Doo reviews, click to the left. Or maybe watch my episode 1 review of Troll Hunters. Thanks for watching and take care.